what's up you guys we're back with another video uh just want to say thank you uh shout out to everybody that been supporting the channel i know my face is a little dirty because uh, i just got out of work um uh, with ryan uh, right here at the new york uh but i'm gonna go right now uh talk to the guy from hoopsters uh right same guy that rap uh, ryan's truck i'm gonna go over there and talk to him about the rap that i was looking for so i am gonna go with the blue color guys um I know I said that blue, either blue, gray, or black, I think, I don't remember. But a lot of people say blue. And that's one color that I always wanted. Uh, so gray, I like the gray too, you know, we'll see what happens. But I seen there's two colors, I think was one was deep blue, and the other one was, was royal blue. Um, but the problem is that for one of them, they're charging too much for the shipping. I think it was like almost $200. Uh, and I was like, man, that's a lot of money, you know? But if I have no choice, then, you know, I'm going to have to get it. But I want to go talk to this guy real quick. And um, his name is Chris. And I want to go talk to him and um, see what, he's, what he thinks uh, about me uh, doing the rap. So we'll see right now, guys. I'll see you guys in a bit. We'll talk about it a little bit more. Seems like it's still open, but like I was saying, I hope the guy is here. So let me go over there and talk to him. Hope he's here. So I could uh, talk to him real quick. See, see what he thinks, guys. Like I said, I hope the guy named Chris is here. So I talked to him before. So let's see if I could see. I hope he's here. Like first, one of you guys already recognized this place. Oh, uh, Ryan come here all the time. So. Gotta ring the bell though. Hello. How hey. you doing? Is Chris here? He's not. He's not? No. Oh. What's up? Because I was trying to see uh, some. I was trying to get a color for a wrap for my uh, truck. I told him before already, but I thought he was going to be here. So. He'll be here all day tomorrow. Yeah? Well, I'll be here most of the day tomorrow. What time he, he's here to tomorrow? Um, should be here till about two tomorrow. Ooh, so I could look at it real quick though, like for um, reps or no? I don't, but otherwise, if you just want to email them, okay, and let them know tomorrow. Yeah, I'll call him tomorrow morning. Um, you should be here like eight thirty or something. Okay, if I have a time, I'll, I'll give him a call. Yeah, then I could. No, so I have him wait for me. All right. All right. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Cheers. Have a good day. You too, man. So, bad look, man. He's not here. Man, that sucks. I'll come. I'll come tomorrow. If not, I'll send an email. Oh, uh, I went to go see the. I went to go look for uh, Chris at the at the uh, the shop, but he wasn't there. So I'm gonna go back tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna head over. I'm gonna head. I'm gonna head right now where I got my truck. I'm gonna start taking um, uh, all the bumpers, the the door handles, and the grill. You know, just stuff that I'm not gonna need no more. And if you got doing the wrap, guys, and if, if you guys have any, if there's guys that done it before or all that, and and you guys have a a better experience than me, uh, don't don't hesitate to hit uh. Leave it in the comment and give me more, uh, help me out, you know? I know a lot of people that probably has done that before many times, or I don't know, or experienced it, or saw somebody do it, and, or anything, but don't just drop it in the comments, guys. Uh, let me know. Just trying to get ahead of time, because, you know, when I when it comes to the rap, I know I'm gonna take a while, and um, I don't want to take too long either. In about a week, uh, maybe a couple days. But I mean, I'm not in a rush, but if I get it done during the week, it'd be awesome. Just wanted to give you a little update um, after I left the shop, what's gonna happen after that. 
um, I was gonna go home, but then I was like, I decided not to go home yet, and uh, which is still early. I think it's already four, but it's already dark over here now. Four already, four p.m. It's already dark, so by five it's like peach black. But yeah, guys, I'll see you guys in a bit because I know you guys can barely see me, but I'll see you guys in a bit. Yep. So I'm gonna go inside. Oh man, I forgot the keys though. All right, looking clean. What's up, Pop? What's up? What's up? What's up? No? Trying to get that door. Get this door open. It's really dark outside, guys, like I'm saying. It's just crazy, though. I hate this time of uh, time changing. I hate it so bad. Because it's just. By five, it's already so dark, man. I hate it. I don't like it at all. Super dark over here. I wish it was like, like the summertime. It's perfect, dude. It's like already 8:30 at night or nine, and it's still sunny. You know, I gotta move this truck out the way, so I could get my truck here in the middle, park a little bit more this way, and I'm just gonna park that one outside. I gotta get the garage open. Well, maybe not. I have to move it. All right, guys. So I got the keys now for my truck. I'm gonna try to move it to the middle. Get this one out the way, real quick. I I parked this truck here because uh, I'm at home. I don't have no space. I really don't have no space at home. Uh, I got all the cars there. So tell you guys, uh, I have to. Uh, I don't know if you guys seen the video I put. Uh, I had a big screen radio. Uh, I got rid of it. I sold it to. I sold it to my brother. Uh, he wondered if he was looking for one, so I sold it to him. And also, guys, um, I want to be. I want to send a shout out to my boy, Lupillo. Uh, he sent. He gave me this. He's he's from Chicago. Uh, I meet I met him at the at the meet and greet that we have with Ryan. He came by and uh, he gave me this. This is really nice, man. So and uh, first like it matches right with my with my truck, but I haven't had the chance to uh, put it on. But just want to send him a shout out. Uh, that's my boy, and I'm still I still talk to him here and there. You know, me hang. Uh, we got a good bond. You know, he's a good 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 people. So just wanted to show him and. Uh, Say thank you for uh for showing uh for giving me this. I will be putting it uh sometime, I don't know when, but sometime soon. Uh, I know I told you guys this before, but I'm gonna get new leather seats, I'm getting new um door panels, just trying to match as much as black I, if I can. Uh because this this right here I don't like them at all. Like and then also guys, this has like the rubber carpet. I don't know how you call that, but it's like rubber, and I don't like that. I think I'm just I'm nervous, man. I ain't gonna lie. I'm nervous. I'm Pretty nervous, but I know I could do it. I know I could do it for sure. But we'll see how it goes, guys. What I'm gonna be doing just do one at a time. Uh, just do this side, and then I'm gonna do the door, and then from the door I'll do this side right here. So which is just one piece, one, and then do this one part by part, and then the bumper. I'm gonna go get rid of the bumper because I'm gonna get. I'm gonna be getting a the HD hood, and the grill gotta go too, and the hood is gonna go too. No. All right, guys, so we're taking the bolts off. Hurry to one of them now. This came out more harder than I thought, man. So, it's a whole process, guys. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, guys, I'm having a little trouble taking these clips off at the grill. I usually hate this, doing this ones because they're just hard to get out. So you never know if this is the stock one. When was the last time if they ever took this one out? Uh so I see there's the bolt. We gotta take that one out. Man, this is more hard than I thought. 
So guys, um, I'm having really bad trouble taking this bolt out. And it's so uncomfortable too. Just trying to have as much as light I can. Está bien duro. Está pasando las pistolas, sí. Sí, pero hay veces, hay veces que no los aguantan. Dale con el tubo. Vaya, vaya. Espérate, cara. Por ahí. Está algo, güey. There's something stuck in here. Por ahí. There's something algo, algo stuck está... in here. So, this is the one that's holding the plastic. So, it's not letting it. Well, let's see if it comes on. Ahí está. There we go. Bumper is out. Yes, sir. <laughs> Just put it right here, bro. Es que sí, bro. Just lay it down right there. Es que sí. So, guys, the bumper is out. Uh, now I'm gonna take some headlights off. So I gotta give me a 10. I don't know if this one is a 10 or not. But, yeah, guys, it's weird because it's gonna be the last time I see. I don't know. But soon it's gonna be the, the time that I see my truck this color. All right, guys, so the hood is out. Uh, we're gonna put it in my dad's basement for now. In the basement, just trying to get things out the way. What the woman in the Also, guys, uh, I'm gonna have the bumper too and the grill. I cover this because it's my place. I'm, I don't want people to know my place, you know, you know what I'm saying. But, anyways, uh, I'm gonna have the bumper for sale. The bumper is on mint condition too. It's really clean. Right now it's a little dirty because I was touching it with my hands, you know. The only thing it has is just little, this scratch right here, which I bought it like that. But other than that, you guys could replace this side. But the hood is in mint condition. You guys can see, look at the paint. It's like, it looks like new, dude. It's look like new, guys. And also the grill. Uh, the grill's painted and the Chevy logo is painted in black. 24 for sale. And also I have the, I also I have the hood for sale. So any of you guys interested, if you guys interested, drop a comment and let me know. Uh, we'll go from there. We'll try to figure out somebody in the Milwaukee area. Hood is in mint condition. It's really take care. You can see, look, even the paint, like it's really clean, guys. It's just really dusty right now because the truck just be sitting in the garage. So anybody that lives in the Milwaukee area or somewhere around here in the Milwaukee area and is interested in buying these rims, I'll find a way to contact you guys. Uh, I'm asking uh, 2400 for them or best offer. Uh, they're not brand new, but they're in good condition. Like you can see the tires are like almost new. I barely got miles on them. It's clean. They're just dirty right now, but I usually keep them clean all over around. And I only have like less than a year with them. Last year was the first year I, I drove with them. All four tires are the same same uh same brand there's not like you know sometimes there's like two different tires or two and two different tires no all four are the same tires they all hold there there's no scratch in the there's no scratch in the rims and none of them as if you guys know so or if you guys know somewhere around here or you're in the chicago area or whatever and you guys want to come get them we can find a way to contact each other and uh and we could i could sell them to you guys because i'm going a different route with uh with the rims so if you guys interested just drop it in the comment and let me know. But yeah, guys. All right, you guys. So this is what I just got done today. Uh, I took the hood off, the bumper, the grill, and the headlights. All right, guys. So like I was saying, that's gonna be it. that's gonna be it for today. I'm gonna wrap it up. And shout out to my brother for helping me out. Thank you, bro, for helping me out. He gave me a hand oh taking God. the bumpers. Give me a little help because I needed two people to take the hood off. So. Let's see how this process goes with the wrap, guys, and then uh, we'll go from there. I'm a little nervous, guys, but I know I can, I'm going to get it done regardless, you know? So, but I know I got it. Thank you guys for watching, and thanks, every one of you, for all the support, and I've been getting lately. I would never thought in my life that I would be doing this. Appreciate it a lot, guys, so I'm going to wrap it up and uh, call it for today. I'll see you guys at the next one.